this is Southwest Rebel. I'm here at the Yuma County Juvenile Detention Center. Do a First Amendment audit. And if you're looking for a job here in Yuma, they are hiring. And there's website. This Aztec High School they have here right now, right next door to the juvenile center is where they used to hold the tent city of Yuma. This whole area used to have a whole bunch of tents for short timers and work release for the Yuma County Jail. If you were sentenced to like six months, you could be put here and it sucked in the summertime. But like I said before, with the wind, you get an awesome view of the flags. This is Southwest Rebel. Uh, after getting on the phone with uh, a couple more experienced auditors, I'm going to go up ahead and go into the visitor area and get some information about how to visit a juvenile inmate for other people that might be curious on how to do that. I love those flags in the wind. I know I say it all the time, but... Hello. How you doing? Um, I'm here to get some information about how to visit a... Uh, somebody who's... Uh, an inmate in here? You'll have to go next door, sir. Okay, that, what is this area here for? This is the, the front entrance to the security. Oh. And also the front entrance for the lobby. Okay, oh, so this is a public lobby? Yes. Okay. 
Yeah, okay. Um, I'd just like to get some brochure oh, information. Yes, oh, but this is a public lobby, isn't yes, it? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, but oh. you don't want any information about uh, someone that's incarcerated, so you'll have to go next door. Well, this is also for, I mean, what do people come in this area for? For information regarding the courts. The, okay. Um, do they have brochures in here for things? Uh, they do. Okay, uh, I'd like to go back there and check yeah, out. You're going to have to put all your stuff down, and we're, you'll have to go through process. Okay, and then you'll hand it back to me over here? Yeah. Okay. my name. Thank you, though. And so you can get some drinks while you wait. I'm very pleased with the way those officers didn't give me much trouble about coming in here. Artwork, I'm guessing by the juveniles that are locked up here. And employee of the quarter. Another another quarter. Is this all the brochures and stuff you have right here? Is this the only area you have brochures? Okay. Let's see what we have here. that, we need detention officers. Oh yeah, I got I did I get that I got that outside already. Yeah, that we need all the publicity we can get. Yes, I, I already, that was at the very beginning of my video. I put that in there. Yeah, from outside, you guys have the same banner across the front, right? Yeah. Yeah, I got it all out there. Yeah. All right. Uh, you know, I appreciate you guys letting me yeah. come in. All right. Yeah. What's your name? My name is Tim Hardy. I'm Tim the director Hardy. of the court. Okay. Yeah, I'm yeah. not out here to cause any no. problems. I'm no, just getting I, information. I understand. All right. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, you know, just sometimes with juveniles, there's just confidentiality, so we can't put juveniles' faces on and stuff like that, but that's why it's the empty lobby are perfectly fine. I, I, yeah, I understand, and, okay. and that's not my intentions at yeah, all. Okay? I understand that. All right, okay. thank you very much. All right, you have a good hey, day. Thank you very much for not giving me a hard time. No, I appreciate no, no, no. it. Hey, you have a great day. You too, sir. And you said about to find out that other information I need, I need to go next door, yes. you said? Okay. Do they have another security thing I'm going to have to go through over there? Uh, no, no. Okay, thank you very much. You guys have a great day. Well, I was very pleased with that. I mean, at first I thought I might be running into some trouble, but hey, here we go. Side two.
no security uh, checkpoint he says so I shouldn't have much issue over here especially since I know I'm already here okay and where we just were at was actually the juvenile court and no security to go into the detention. And he's going in to let them know I'm coming, I guess. No, but I don't have a problem with that because he didn't try to impede my right to film inside. Okay, there was nothing really to see in there, and so I decided not to film in there. I mean, there's a lot of mothers, and they're going through a hard time, parents with kids that just, uh, some need to be here, and some uh, just have a little issue and shouldn't be here at all, like my brother and I, who, my mother went for help, and the help we received was putting us into this place. I mean, it was located somewhere else, but... No, no, actually it was here at the same location. It was just remodeled and torn down and rebuilt. All right, thank you very much. You have a great day. I really appreciate your, your uh, honoring your oath and uh, re really respecting the community. So thank you very much. You too. All right, this is Southwest Rebel, and I'm out.